If you want to make Slack fun, then you can use something called a GIF keyboard. And to do that, you can simply go around here on to the app section because it is an app and you can go around here and install GIF. So I'm just going to go around and search right here by typing in GIF and then all, uh, all uh, GIF related apps will pop up. So the ones, the apps that you see uh, right away is uh, just a uh, just tiny fraction of the entire collection of apps that a Slack has. So you can just search around right here and add in the GIF keyboard, which ha we had been searching for. So I'm just going to go around and click on add and the new tab will open up where we'll have to install it to Slack. That is, we click on add to Slack and what happens is that I'll have to allow the GIF keyboard to work around just like that. So these are the permissions. So I'm just going to click on allow. And then once it installs, as you can see, it says successfully added uh, turn out to Slack right here. I'm able to send out GIFs to others. So you can see that uh, GIF keyboard is here just like this. And to use GIF keyboard, you can see that now I'll have to use the tenor. Okay, the tenor tagline right here. So let, let us try that out. So let's say, for example, I can type in tenor, good job. So let's try that out right here. So that's backslash tenor, uh, happy girl, right over here, press enter. And what happens is that it searches for a lot of zips right here. And it can choose the one that you want. Let's say, for example, I want to send this. I simply click on this. I can even add caption and you can see that zip has been integrated. I can go around into random and I'm going to go around and try that out. So I can type in tenor and let's say, for example, I want to search for something like computer right here. So that's uh, what is going to be searched out. So I'm just going to go around and send this one because I find it funny. I can also add in a caption right there. So monkey computer, just like this. I can click on send right here. And then what happens is that uh, that will be uh, just uh, added in. So you can see that there's the keyboard as well. I mean, like there's the keyword monkey computer as well. And there's the GIF and that has been in integrated. So that is how you can use the GIF keyboard inside of Slack. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.